Okay. Um, first of all, I just want to thank everyone uh, for staying here today. Uh, I think we had a really good turnout, and I really appreciate your uh, participation. I want to just say that the conversation doesn't end here. Uh, the whole um, goal behind our organization is to foster communication and, and just keep that communication channel open. And um, if you guys want to talk more about any of these uh, topics, um, you know, tomorrow or two months from now or whatever, just uh, feel free to ring us up. Um, we're very passionate about this kind of stuff and, and uh, we'd be happy to talk more. Um, so several of you um, indulged me and went to the uh, enterprisemediawiki.org uh, site and created a uh, user page. Uh, we've got a total of uh, 24 uh, people that uh, made an account, so I'd say we got a pretty good uh, participation level there. And this is just a, a very uh, simple example of how uh, flexible a wiki is and how you can also use uh, the power of a database uh, to run queries and, and show data in different ways uh, using templates as uh, Dan Ostermeyer talked about earlier. Um, things as simple as just a, a list of the people that uh, decided to make their account. Um, obviously tables are a very uh, common way to display data. And I want to point out I, I, I shaded um, some of these uh, regions uh, dark gray. It looks like I forgot to do it in the other columns. Um, but the point is uh, this is one of the extensions that allowed us to start uh, identifying gaps in our knowledge base. We actually found data that we was missing. We just didn't have the data. Sometimes it's better to know what you don't know than it is to know what you know. Sounds like a song, the lyrics to a song. Uh, some people even uh, posted pictures of themselves. Uh, looks like Justin uh, got to meet um, Smokey the Bear, so that's cool. Uh, <laughs> And so we've also got uh, locations of people. We've got some people that traveled very far uh, to come here today, and I really do appreciate that. Um, we've uh, taken that data and shown it in a plot or in a graph, as well as in a plot here, calculating distance from their location to this building. Um, and then just some uh, word clouds and pie charts showing the distribution of uh, where people work and how much experience they have, how many years experience, what kind of uh, roles they have. You can see we've got uh, about a third of the people here are users, a third of the people are system administrators, and then we've got an assortment of other, other roles, including developers. Um, this started off very MediaWiki heavy, but then I think David Meza went in there and put in a whole bunch of other tools, like Shiny and Tom Sawyer. I don't know if that's a tool or a book, but I'm going to learn about it. <laughs> Uh, and then finally, it was interesting to see, uh, we just kind of left this free form, KM interests. What are you interested in? You know, initially, we thought maybe this would be how we could solicit ideas for collaboration, and we just kind of left it out there and just let's see what happens. And it is interesting um, seeing the different ideas out there, including someone's very interested in bacon. Um, <laughs> but that's all right. Bacon's good. Um, so uh, first, I'd like to ask uh, the presenters that are still here to come on up. Uh, we've got some posters to share. So uh, Cora, David, uh, Rohit, Dan, and Dan Ostermeyer already left, but uh, those of you that are left, yeah. So there's a poster, yeah, would you mind? You talk. Yeah. Yeah, we've got some cool NASA swag we figured we'd, we'd share with those that uh, took time out of their busy schedule to uh, share their expertise with us. So uh, thank you again uh, to our presenters. Okay, back on the uh, people data page, I just have a couple more awards and we are going to totally make four o'clock, so don't you worry. Uh, I did want to acknowledge those that traveled the farthest, and it looks like Cora won that award. So uh, we've got a poster, we've got two of these. So first place, uh, this is uh, a poster with all the different mission patches. And then second place goes to uh, Mark Hirschberger. Now, I don't know if Jane... Jumala, Jumala, 
Is Jane here or is Jane a remote participant? <laughs> I think Jane might be a remote. If you're here, speak up. <laughs> yeah, so thank you for dialing in. Uh, we do appreciate our uh, remote viewers and uh, hopefully you'll uh, contact us um, after, day, after today and keep the conversation going. Let's see, so uh, just a couple more. Um, I wanted to go down here and identify uh, a few people that that shared their thoughts about what what um, characteristics uh, they're interested in, in in knowledge management. So uh, Perry Rodriguez, you still here? Yeah. Let's do this one. Thank you for sharing your thoughts on the knowledge management ideas. Let's see, uh, Darian Vela. Are you here? Yes. Hopefully I said it right. Thank you. And we had a couple more. Uh, Sivaram and Michael. Michael Alabastro. Would you mind? All right. We should probably just call it there. Um, so um, thank you very much for coming today. Uh, we've got some uh, sandwiches and stuff left over. Feel free to pilfer through that on your way out. Otherwise, uh, have a good afternoon.